The Soybean School on realagriculture.com is brought to you by Pride Seeds, Aragon LQ Pre-Harvest Weed Control, and Fortenza Vibrance Max Plus Saltro. Bernard Tobin here on the Soybean School down in Pancor today, Ontario, at the Pride Education Center with Matt Chapel. Matt, how's it going? It's going good, Bern. How about you? I'm pretty good. I'm pretty good. I want to talk about a little bit of research you're doing here. Um, a lot of discussion this spring, obviously in dry conditions, about how deep we could go with soybeans. A lot of people want to stay at one, one and a half. Some people get scared when it gets that moisture goes away and want to drive deep, two and a half and three. You got an interesting site here. You've done a flag test on different depths. Tell us what you learned. Yeah, Bern. So, of course, we uh, field a lot of calls every spring. How deep do I plant my soybeans? And that is a loaded question because I need to know your planting tools, your residue, your, your weather forecast, uh, what are you using to plant, blah, 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 and where's that moisture layer, of course. So, regardless of all those factors, Bern, we, we took into account that we're just going to set the planter at three different depths on different planting dates. So, this particular demonstration we're looking at one inch deep we wanted to get that carbon copy plant just like we do in our cornfields right here is one inch seeded depth on april 7th these beans hardly laid in moisture they went through a lot of weather they saw snow three weeks after planting and this is a day one emerger right here this is a day four emerger in that flag test i think there is a dramatic difference in overall yield potential pod set this is a weak spindly plant from being planted shallower it probably bounced a little bit burn and wasn't that one inch and it is diseased and definitely not a carbon copy like we saw in other plants in the field next we look at a two inch planting depth and i will say that when the two inch planting depth emerged it was much more consistent you have a lot more plants that look like that with consistent node set consistent pod set and a more consistent count of pods per plant and then even more dramatically burn, not normally do what I do this on April 7th, plant beans, but also to plant them at three inches deep into cold, wet, miserable soils. And one inch, three inch, these beans were up at least a week later than the one inch of uh, planted beans, but they branched out a lot more. They're a very stout, compact plant. And maybe you could say they're a much more efficient plant for sunlight usage. And there's good pod set on those. So an interesting observation that says, maybe as we plant soybeans deeper, we are able to get a more consistent stand, more carbon copied plants, and good yield for our emerged stand. <laughs>